Welcome back everyone to Empyrean Galactic Survival Reforged Eden. After having looted many POIs last episode, I think we're ready to go and continue the storyline. My base is all uh, configured to protect itself in case base attacks start up. Um, we will be dealing with some Xerox on these missions, I, if I recall correctly. Um, I don't know if it's going to us on the map or not. First things first, we gotta get that pulse rifle on my person. Who did that from the uh one of the POIs? And it's a pretty good early game weapon. And I also need some ammo for it. Uh yeah, rifle rounds. All right. The only thing we're really lacking is decent armor. But uh, we can live with this, I think. One of the advantages of having the SV when you're going to be doing all these uh, missions here is uh, the SV will be doing most of the uh, shooting I probably won't need to use the pulse rifle at all. But let's go say hi to the chief. Doggos running around. Hey, Chief. I swear that looks like uh, Tahitian or maybe Ma Maori. Set some sort of South Pacific language, it looks like. read all, all of the text there it's you know storyline apparently he's sending us off to a little tower to do something I still have the abandoned outpost on my radar there I just sure is chatty it's a lot of exposition to get through. So, where's the tower? I mean, the tower. Yeah, those darn kids. Get off my lawn! Isn't that convenient? It's just dead ahead. Now in vanilla, usually there's like spiders running around on the outside here. Blair? Spiders? Spiders? Anyone? You see them. Maybe it's different in Reforge. I'm trying to think back to the last time I played Reforge. nice there's an elevator there that's alone is very different than the uh vanilla version vanilla version you you have to drop down and you can't get back up through there all right Ida, what are we doing here come on out with it i think they give you a, a little too much time to read the text there Maybe it's just me. In my elementary and high school, or I'm 
that we had uh, speed reading lessons. So I am a pretty fast reader. And there's no basement to this one either, like in Vanilla, apparently. No infected Alan downstairs, moaning and groaning. Okay, I can live with that. Makes things a little easier. So what am I supposed to do? I, uh, come on. Get on with it. Yes, get on with it. Yes! Story, 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 story. In the year 1832, Slowly the silence spread. It's not there are more silence we've been hearing about. Though maybe not here in Eden. Reforged Eden. Okay. And Fennel, the red that red panel blows up after you look at it. Sorry to signatures moving in on the tower formation. Alright, some bad guys, the Araxian scum, perhaps? Can I go out and kill him? Hello? Hello? Anybody? Oh, I think I broke the game. I just noticed I was supposed to stand clear of the red console. I think I was supposed to wait around down there until the console blew up and that would have spawned in the Zaraxian scums. Well, isn't that a pisser? I was sort of looking forward to killing me some Xerax. Oh well. I think I'm gonna have to go in here and just pretend that I did. Let's not pretend that we did. Suspicion. Isn't that an Alfred Hitchcock movie? But he told us we were coming. Told them we were coming. Okay. Where's the chief? The chief moved over to this other village. Wanted to be nearby, I guess. Chief gets around. Where's the front door? I usually look for the big white sails, but this is a smaller village. Doesn't have them. All right, I'll put my gun away. We're all friends here, I think. Story, story. Okay, I gotta go talk to the huntmaster, or the head hunter, as it is. 
in the list there. I don't think that word means what you think it means. Is he a headhunter? Or the headhunter? Great. Gotta find the tower. I think it's back where the other village was. The mountain, you mean... T yep. Alright, if I recall this one... Definitely be a couple a couple of the Zerakians come around here. Once I trigger them. I gotta go inside and threaten Kiev. Yo, Keith, you've been an oldie boy. Guess we're gonna do this the hard way. Well, not hard for me. I got a ship with gats on it. Die, oh, Xerxene scum. Where's the other one? Where's your buddy? There he is. I do have to remember I don't have any shields. I can't take too much of that. Damn, ooh. There he is, he's shooting at me with his crossbow. Yeah, my rooftop and got him. Automagically. He's really bloody. Alright, where's the other guy? There? Where's the other corpse? It's over here. Mm, he's got a sandwich. Nom, nom, nom. Nom. That'll taste good after a hard day's killing. Okay, I'm well, the chief is back over here. And he gets around. He gets around fast, too. I should repair this. We don't forget. Take a few, a few dings. <laughs> what state the ship is in? How can you tell it's been damaged? Okay, Chief. What's the deal? Self-defense, honest. Is that what Ida is? A machine mind. Where did the Terran survivors go? Trade station. I guess we're all friends with the Talon now. And we're gonna have to go deal with the Polaris, the Ferengi of this game. The only morality they know is cash. Okay, where is the trade station? Get on with it, Ida. Is. 
only three clicks away. What's a click? Uh. Just want to make sure I'm not going to cross through Xerxian space. It's sort of an experiment of mine. I don't see how how long I can go before uh, trigger base attacks. Maybe they don't trigger at all. What, what, what is this? Squadron of bombers. Oh yeah, I remember. Ida is trying to be funny. Actually, it's a very good way to train you for what's coming next. I think it's the first time we heard the, the klaxon sound there. Get us ready for attacks. Hi everyone. Uh, barkeep. Bartender is the common source of information, sure. Hmm. I think I broke it. I hit the F key before the uh, dialogue started, I think. I was supposed to talk to him about my people. That's all right. The next part is started automatically there. Looking for my crew. No, I don't want to. A bike. But I will take a look at what you've got. Okay. Looks like you can take about 17 multi tools for 178 each. I can make some of those and get some more money. Uh, second best would be a shotgun and 40 a piece. Just looking for a way to make some cash. I'm gonna need to buy um need to buy a a what EVA booster and small electronic bridges there for um CPU extenders for the truckster. I should deposit what little cash I have. Look at that. I got 60 credits in the bank. Talk to this guy. Get a job with Polaris here. What do I get out of this? Healthcare, dental. Do we need to sign anything? Eight three seven. That's all I remember is for three digits. Okay, so we got to go survey tower and protect it from some Xeraxian drones. Uh, let me make sure I'm not going to hit Xerax territory. Nope. Okay. Do have to be careful. I gotta always remind myself I still have no shields. I'm so used to having shields on the SV. In 
cute little breathing room. Take some hits, but uh, have to be careful. Generally, the way to avoid is just to keep moving, and uh, especially with um, the drones getting above them, they have a hard time shooting up. I turned off the uh, predators for the rooftop turret, so they'll concentrate. Rooftop turret will concentrate on the uh, the drones. And as long as I keep moving, we should be fairly safe. Let's see, we've got to get close to the surveyor. There he is. Do I have to hop out to trigger this? Yeah. Hi, guy. Uh, I'm supposed to protect you, and you're supposed to get the hell out of here. Okay, here we go. Bombers. Well, that's okay. Bombers have a hard time hitting the broadside of a barn. Go get him, rooftop gun. Go get him. They are hard to hit because they're so janky. That guy. Where does he land? So I'm gonna loot him. Usually he has some good stuff on him. Okay, he's right at the water's edge. How about you, you bastard? Gotcha. Where are you going? I'm all turned around. Here we go. Stuck in the trees, are ya? Give me your stuff. Oh, you stuck on my front end here. Get off. Meanwhile, I wasn't reading the storyline, but it says right there, return to Officer Harabel. Uh, security manager, there he is. Okay. Moving right along. I should get some cash out of this deal and I can get the uh, EVA boost. I will be needing. So, I recall correctly, the uh, they're going to send me to space station next. However, in the meantime, I, I think I'll start uh, building the truckster and tearing this one apart. I may not be able to get uh, shields in it or even the warp tank, but I'm pretty sure I can get uh, the basic outlines of it built and it'll be uh, more than enough to get through the next parts of the story. And in the meantime, I can also do some manufacturing of multi-tools, shotguns, bring them over here and sell them, uh, get the cash built up so I can buy the small optronic bridges I'm going to be needing. I don't think I want to try to attack the uh, drone base on this planet until I do have shields. 
usually the uh, drone bases have got a lot of foot soldiers around, around shooting at you, so you're getting shot at from all sides. If you don't have shields, you're as good as dead. And the uh, drone base is usually shielded. Okay, apparently I'm close enough to this guy to talk to him through the window. Okay, yes. Mm hmm. Show me the money. Next two. Security fleet in the middle of the block. How many people were left? I don't care. Blah, blah, blah. Next station, transport hub, pilot. An idiot that flies a ship just like you. Isn't he a pleasant chap? Let's deposit our pay here. 15,000 credits. That's a nice start. I want to get that EVA boost before I forget. I could just go out and get some gold. Mine some gold and make it, but... Uh, let's see what else we got. Bandages? I don't I think I'll buy some of those as well. Okay. Talk to the pilot. How much to get that bell oiled? A little bribery here and there. 80 credits, fine, no problem. Natasha Emerson. Okay. The Kroll stars. Yes, we are going, going up into orbit. Eventually, I say. Because I do think I want to uh, take this lull in the business here. Let's start building the. Uh, the truckster, which means tearing this guy apart. I think I have enough raw materials to get the uh, get it pretty well started. Okay, home again. And I think that next part of the storyline will wait for me up there in orbit. Uh, let's put stuff away that we're not going to be needing. Some of those big fuel tanks. Rifle upgrade kits. Got two of those now. I think I can sell them since I do have the upgraded rifle already. Pulse rifle. Okay. Well, I think that's it for today. Then all that become a man. Uh, next episode uh, will be building the truckster and when we get that as much get it done as much as we can we'll head into space but for now as always thanks for joining me and hope to see you again tomorrow <laughs>